to Firefox or to not Firefox, that's the question. And after a while, um, realizing that Firefox ran more efficiently within the Dell Mini, um, I decided, hey, that I can't make IE my only browser and downloaded Firefox. And um, I tried a couple of the different options out there like Opera, uh, but Firefox for me tended to be the best thing. Now, there, there was an issue with, um, or one of the issues that people face with Firefox is um, what about those sites that um, don't allow you to, or Microsoft only sites that prefer you using Microsoft based tools, maybe give you a stripped down version of uh, the program. And with the Mini, because you're going to want to use it, the tool uh, to the fullest of your ability, it's probably something that you want to be able, when you go on the web, you want to get the fullest utility out of the program. So, within Firefox, I actually found a pretty cool add-in, and this add-in is called IE Tab. Uh, it is a plug-in for, for Firefox or Firefox extension. Once you install this, uh, you have a pretty cool ability. Uh, you have the ability to choose if you're going to be using Firefox's or Microsoft's rendering engine to put your page up. So let me go to a site that I've already configured. Uh, it's our corporate web web mail site. I'm not going to go all the way into the site, um, but you'll be able to see. If you go in with a typical Firefox browser, um, you're going to be forced to use Outlook Web Access Lite. Uh, which is pretty restrictive uh, in the abilities. It's, it's exchange is a lot easier to work with um, with IE. And I, I can give you a perfect example. If I want to change rendering engines, all I have to do is go up to the tab and switch. And now I am forced to use Outlook Web, Web Access Lite. Again, this program is called IE Tab. Uh, it's available as a free extension to Firefox, and it will make you much more efficient in using Firefox with your Dell Mini.